Thanks, Ian. A trip to Walmart turned into a trip to jail for an Albuquerque mom accused of getting her little girls to help her steal. Ms. Garduño, good morning. This is contributing to the delinquency of a minor. 34-year-old Valerie Garduño appeared in court yesterday. She was arrested Thursday at the Walmart store near Coors and I-40. A store employee told police Garduño was seen having her 9-year-old and 14-year-old daughters place stolen merchandise inside their bags and then trying to leave the store. She wanted to speak up in court yesterday, but the judge stopped her short. Have you reviewed the complaint? Yes. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. You don't want to say anything. You want to talk about this complaint in private with an attorney. Garduño was allowed to stay out of jail, but she can't go back to the Walmart. A man with a long history of drunk driving is in trouble again this morning. 43-year-old Simon Flores was arrested just after midnight Friday for what could turn out to be his seventh DWI conviction. Flores was spotted driving erratically by a Bernalillo County Sheriff's deputy, pulling over and then taking off again repeatedly, eventually parking and taking off on foot on Bermejo near 2nd and Osuna. A deputy finally found him hiding. According to the criminal complaint, Flores blew a .16 on a breath test. Yesterday, Metro Court Judge Daniel Ramzik learned Flores has a total of nine DWI arrests in his past with six convictions. The judge set Flores' bond at 25000 cash only. Sir, your DWI history is quite significant and disturbing. And 24-year-old Kyle Halona was also in court yesterday. He has four drunk driving convictions so far. According to Albuquerque police, he had a 4-year-old and 13-year-old child with him when they caught him driving drunk again. The kids were in the back seat when Halona was spotted swerving near Montgomery and San Pedro on Thursday. Halona is now charged with aggravated DWI and two counts of child abuse. Halona's bond is set at 55000 cash or surety. A former New Mexico police officer accused of getting a 15-year-old pregnant while still on the force has turned himself in. 29-year-old Noah Pestak was a truth or consequences police officer at the time. He later married the teen and resigned as a cop. State police got an arrest warrant Friday charging Pestak with rape of a minor, contributing to the delinquency of a minor and tampering with evidence. Pesek has already been released from jail on a $25,000 cash-only bond. He faces up to nine years in prison if convicted. Accused of stealing from his own sister. McKinley County Sheriff's deputies say 25-year-old Joshua Malone has admitted to using a rock to break a window and steal several items from his sister's home, including a laptop and a flat-screen TV. Malone's sister told deputies that her brother later called and admitted to stealing her stuff. It's an annual trip he's been taking for nearly two